Okay, if you could look at the camera, say your first and last name and how many laps we're doing here today. Sam Newell, seven laps. All right, Sam, my name is Mike Finani. I'll be your coach for the next seven laps here in the Porsche Turbo. Awesome. Um, first time driving on a racetrack, yes? Yep. First car with us today, yes? Yep. All right, perfect. So first thing you're going to notice is the mirrors in here, except for me, not for you. Um, we do that because once you get out there, you'll see it be plenty busy just keeping us going around the track safely and quickly. Okay. Um, so we don't want to have to have you worry about traffic, so that'll be my job. Um, so if we get caught by a faster car, I'll let you know that we're going to let somebody pass. When I do that, just don't slam on the brakes in front of them, obviously. Okay. <laughs> um, if we catch up to a slower car that we want to pass, hang out behind them until I give you the go-ahead. And then uh, either way, as the pass is happening, I'm going to place my hand on the wheel. When I do that, I'm not steering for you. I'm just going to help guide you since okay. you can't see where they're at in the mirror. So if you feel me tugging one way or the other, that's just me trying to give the other car enough room to make the pass clean and safe. Okay. Um, so don't fight me on it. Okay. Um, paddles are right there behind your hands. So once we get on, you'll probably have to move your hands around the wheel maneuvering through the, the pit area here. But once we get on the track, they should be just where they're at right now, nine and three. Shouldn't have to move them that way. They're always at the ready at the paddles. Um, and then um, most of the track's gonna be in third gear on this car. Okay. Um, most of the tracks are very similar speed corners, so we just stay in third gear. The only time we're really going to be shifting is on the straightaway, okay. uh, where we'll get up to fourth, and then we'll get on the brakes at the end of the straightaway, and just before we turn in, we'll hit it down into third again, and then we're back in third till the rest until we come back to the straightaway. Um, key to driving fast is just being smooth, so we don't want to make any any jerky movements. We don't want to stomp on the gas pedal. We don't want to stomp on the brakes or any of that stuff. Because um, if we have any steering input in the wheel, it's going to break our traction loose right. and either spin us around or the traction control will catch us. Either way, it's not very fast. So, <laughs> so just be smooth with it and I'll coach you around, coach you on technique. I'll coach you around the track since obviously you don't, you don't have it memorized. Um, and then we'll go from there. You got any questions? Um, nope. All right. Well, if you're ready to go, put on the brake for me. Get you in the manual, you're already in first gear, so give it a little throttle to get her moving. And out of the tent, hang left. And just like this Lamborghini is about to do, we're going to crank it right at the end of the wall. Crank it right. Go pull up just past the wall, then come to a stop. Make sure we got clear track. A little further for me. All right, that's good. We're all clear. So go ahead, make your way left. Onto the track, straight ahead. Once you get out there, stay to the left-hand side. Get up into second gear. Good. At this first green cone, start your turn in down to your first apex. Start to gently squeeze it on the throttle. Let it go out to this cone, foot to the floor. There it is. Up shift. You don't have to lift off the throttle either, you can keep okay. your foot in it. Upshift again. Then at these cones, hard brakes, okay? Then downshift one time. Release the brakes, turn in at the cone, down to your next set of cones. No throttle yet. Turn, turn, turn. Now squeeze it on as you exit wide. There we go. Keep going, more throttle. Stay to the left, then hard brakes again. A little more. Slowly release the brakes, turn into your next set of cones. Light throttle for me. Back around to the right, a little more throttle. Light brakes at the top of the hill, release the brakes, turn it in, light throttle. It's going to get light over this crest, and then once we land, we add throttle again. Good, stay to the left, then brakes. This is the slowest corner on the track, so you got to wait all the way down there. And slow hands, turn it in, and squeeze the throttle on. Go, go, go. Tightens up at the end there, but that was perfect. Throttle, there you go. Off the throttle, turn in at your cone, perfect, light brakes. Throttle straight line all the way out to the single cone there on the left, light brakes again. Release the brakes, turn it in, and throttle, foot to the floor all the way out wide. There we go. Whoa! Upshift. She's quick, huh? Yeah. Good, hard brakes, harder, 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 downshift. Release the brakes all the way in, turn, no throttle, keep turning, keep turning. There we go, squeeze the throttle on, go, go, go. Good, on the brakes. A little more, a little more. Release the brakes, turn it in, all the way in there. Don't follow this Ferrari, you might not do it right. Squeeze the throttle on. There we go, light brakes at the top. See, he did not. So we're gonna tuck him behind. He's gonna let us pass on the right throttle. More throttle, more throttle. Good, then hard brakes. Okay, we're a little slower. We're gonna hold this line tight. A little bit of throttle. A little bit more, full throttle. Go, go, go. There we go, up shift. 
Good. Good. Light brakes. Back in left. And light throttle all the way out. Then brakes again. Release the brakes. Turn it in. No throttle yet. Now throttle. Go, go, go. Pass you 
go, the quicker it is. Oh man, that was <laughs> <laughs> right oh, right through here. Nice job, my man. Oh, Very smooth. Thank you. That was fun. You have a natural talent for this. Oh. It's a good car, isn't it? It's an awesome car. I have to come <laughs> again. Imagine how quick you can get back to Provo. I know, right? Probably not too good in the snow, though. I don't know. <laughs> not much snow right <laughs> Might now. Might be worth it, yeah. We're going to park right behind this guy, and then when he's done, we'll pull up in the water box and he'll pull the car off. There we go. That was ridiculous. Is this the only one you're driving today? Yeah, but I'm doing the ride along. Oh, right on. Yeah, you'll enjoy that. I hope so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it will be amazing. Vinny is crazy. Thanks, man. Oh, appreciate thank it. you. I appreciate that. That was so fun. Yeah, good. Glad Seven you enjoyed laps it, man. is not enough. I know. <laughs> Get done with seven laps, like I just feel used to the track and the car. Yeah. You did good though, man. I'm telling you, it doesn't get much faster. That was fun. I'm glad we have you sit next to me. Cause yeah, it makes it shortens the learning there's curve. There's no way you know what to do. You know, I've yeah. never, I've driven a, driven my bullet bike and that's it, but it's not a car. Yeah, yeah. No, there's no way you get that little lapse and be. Well, first of all, half of these cars would probably be. In a, in a ball at the end of turn one off the track somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> but. This car is ridiculously fast. It is, isn't it? It's one of my favorites. Which like one it's is not your as, favorite to drive? Uh, you know, like this one. If if it were like if they were like, hey, you're gonna you're gonna race everybody out here. Yeah. This would be one of my top three. Okay. For like lap time wise, because um, it's just fast. But I really like the Italia uh -huh. because it's just as fast. But it also has like this, the really cool noises and like the yeah. really cool shifting and things like that. And it's a Ferrari, it's a Ferrari. so it has like a cooler ambiance. But yeah, because this one like the turbos quiet the motor down a lot. And yeah, it's, you know, Porsche hasn't changed anything in 30 years. Right. So <laughs> I mean, which I mean, it's a very good car. Yeah. But it doesn't have the flash as some of the Ferraris and Lamborghinis. But it is real quick. Which Lamborghini is the best? Do you think? I like the Super Legera. It's the lightweight, like half race car version of it. Good to go. We'll go ahead and park it. Put on the brake for me. All right, underneath the tent. The Super Legera is like the lightweight version. Uh huh. It doesn't have power seats. Half of them don't even come with radios. Like there's no leather or anything inside. Nice. Just stripped down. Yeah, we'll park it right here. Man, that was awesome. That's fun. Right here is good. But I'll say I'm a Ferrari fan over Lamborghinis for yeah. sure. Let's get your video.